Today, I'm going to be teaching you how to rickroll and scratch. It's super easy, and you know, sometimes revenge is super sweet. Okay, so we're going to go to Giphy.com and search up rickroll. Find one that you like and click on it. Now, right click to reveal the side panel and save the image as. Finally, click save. Now, go back to scratch and upload or draw a convincing picture to entice your viewer. For this one, I used AI to make it look like GTA 6. Now add some text telling the user to click the spacebar. Next, as a costume, upload the GIF and it'll take a couple seconds, but now you should have a lot more costumes. Finally, go into the coding tab and add the following code. One green flag clicked and switch costume to that image that you created earlier. Drag in a when spacebar clicked and a forever loop. Add a switch costume to the very first frame of your rickroll and a repeat loop. Since there are 32 costumes in this sprite, set the repeat loop to 32. Inside your repeat loop, add a wait 0.05 seconds in a next costume. Let's run it. The menu looks okay and the rickroll seems to work. However, you'll notice that there's a flash off the menu screen. To fix this, let's change the repeat loop by minus 1. Now the rickroll is smooth and scuffed. But if other people are going to be successfully rickrolled, they need to buy your story. On the project page, elaborate and make it seem like an actual game. Put detailed instructions, faked bugs, and just anything to make it seem legit. And there you have it. The perfect scratch project rickroll. If you enjoyed this video and want more of it, like, subscribe, just do something to tell me you want more of this content. Thank you for watching and as always, see you in the next video.